Whoa, huge breaking news. Yes, right. What's up? All right. going on everybody how are y'all doing quick news breaking news fresh off the press sony has just reversed their plans for closing the playstation 3 playstation vita the past stores that fans were raging oh they're closing these stores sony has just announced players will be able to continue to purchase games on PlayStation 3 and PlayStation Vita. This is coming from the official PlayStation blog. Let's get to the news and of course, give the video a like, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Here we go. <coughs> this is coming from Jim Ryan, president and CEO of Sony Interactive Entertainment. This is what he says. Recently, we notified players that PlayStation Store for PlayStation 3 and PlayStation Vita devices was planned to end this summer. Upon further reflection, however, it's clear that we made the wrong decision here. So today, I'm happy to say that we will be keeping the PlayStation Store operational for PlayStation 3 and PlayStation Vita devices. PlayStation Portable com commerce functionality will retire on july 2nd 2021 as planned and so playstation vita stores playstation 3 stores remaining open but playstation the original playstation portable psp those stores are still shutting down <coughs> when we initially came to the decision to end purchasing support for playstation 3 and playstation vita it was born out of a number of factors including commerce support challenges for older devices and the ability for us to focus more of our resources on newer devices where a majority of our gamers are playing on we see now that many of you are incredibly passionate about being able to continue continue purchasing classic games on playstation 3 and playstation vita for the foreseeable future so I'm glad we were able to find a solution to continue operations. I'm glad that we can keep this piece of our history alive for gamers to enjoy while we continue to create cutting edge new game worlds for PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, and the next generation of VR. Thank you for sharing your feedback with us. We're always listening and appreciate the support from our PlayStation community kudos to jim ryan they admitted they made a mistake and they're saying that they're listening to the fans now if we could get enough noise for nintendo to bring back the mario 3d all-stars <laughs> nintendo ain't about that life Nintendo's like too bad too sad but uh, i th thought this was great great and so they reversed that decision great news what do you guys think about this news sound off in the comment section below i want to know but before you go bro Click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things gaming, bro. Days Gone Developer. Still mad. Watch my last video. You know what I'm talking about. You still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I gotta hook you up. That's right. I'm giving away a $60 digital code every month for your platform of choice. Xbox, Nintendo, or PlayStation. Two ways to enter. One, make sure you're subscribed to this fire right here on YouTube. Two, follow me on Twitter at ob one plays and that's it. You're in for the giveaway. But wait, there's more. Do you want to join an awesome gaming Discord with prizes and tournaments? Do you want to get on my friend list and game with your boy? Become a sponsor. Three ways to join. One, subscribe on Twitch. If you have Twitch Prime, you can do it for free. Two, click the join button right here on YouTube and become a member. And the third way to join, patreon.com backslash obi1plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. I'll see you later.